Hello everyone I hope you all are doing well in today's edition we are going to talk about Aluri Sitarama Raju and the Rampa rebellion now recently the 125th birth anniversary of freedom fighter Aluri Sitarama Raju and 100 years of Rampa rebellion were observed and in wake of this our prime minister also unveiled a 30 foot tall bronze statue of Aluri Sitarama Raju that was in Bhimavaram in Andhra Pradesh from where he belonged So let us talk about Aluri Sita Rama Raju. He was born in the year 1897 in Bhimavaram of the present day Andhra Pradesh to Aluri Venkat Rama Raju and Surya Narayana Ma. He was an Indian revolutionary who waged an armed campaign against the British colonial rule in India. He was known for his guerrilla warfare tactics so therefore he was nicknamed as Manyam Virudu that means hero of the jungle that was by the local villagers. Now let us talk about his contribution to the freedom struggle and the welfare of tribal groups the local people or tribals regarded him as a mystic as a saint who would rescue them from their humiliating existence at the hands of british authorities he became sanyasi at the age of 18 he had knowledge in the fields of medicine astrology and also how to tame the wild animals initially Aluri Sitarama Raju was under the influence of Gandhi ji's non-cooperation movement and he also inspired the tribals to seek justice in the local panchayat but sooner he realized that these steps did not decrease the suffering of the local people therefore he led the famous Rampa rebellion or which is also known as the Manyam rebellion after his nickname Manyam Virudu that was in the year 1922 Aluri Sita Rama Raju had a huge patriotic spark. He laid his life for the freedom of the motherland. He was determined to achieve freedom and he had undying spirit of sacrifice and unwavering commitment towards freedom. He was executed in the year 1924 by the British. That was after 2 years of efforts. So that is how he sacrificed his life for the freedom struggle. Now let us talk about some of the recognitions given by the government. A postal stamp has been released in his honor at the village of Mogalu and also there is a new district that was named after him. Most importantly, recently a 30 feet tall bronze statue was released as a part of 125th birth anniversary celebrations that is at the Peda Amiram village near Bhimavaram in the western Godavari that is in Andhra Pradesh. Also as a part of Azadi ka Amrit Mahotsav this event will be celebrated throughout the year further on the 4th of July is also celebrated as a state festival in Andhra Pradesh now let us talk a bit about the Rampa rebellion or as it is also known as the Manyam rebellion so it was a tribal uprising that was obviously led by Aluri Sitarama Raju in the Godavari district of the then Madras presidency in the British India so he was against the Madras Forest Act of 1882 Now this Madras Forest Act banned the villagers or locals the tribals from opting for podu cultivation. Podu cultivation was a type of shifting cultivation. It was also known as podu chaso, majorly practiced in Odisha, Andhra Pradesh etc. Shifting cultivation uses the slash and burn methods. Now under this Madras Forest Act of 1882, the Britishers forced the villagers to raise particular type of crops. Now this act also laid severe curbs on the movement in the forest area. Therefore he inspired the tribals to fight against the injustices of the British and he was famously known for the guerrilla warfare tactics so this was a little bit about Aluri Sitarama Raju let's take up one practice question now with reference to the history of India Ulgulan or the great tumult is the description of which of the following events a it is the revolt of 1857 b the mapilla rebellion of 1921 c the indigo revolt of 1859 60 or d it is the birsa munda's revolt of 1899 you can write your answers in the comment section below so the correct answer to this is option d that is ulgulan or the great tumult refers to the birsa munda's revolt of 1899 and with this we call it a wrap of today's edition of topic of the day i hope you like the video i will see you with some other topic tomorrow till then take care and do stay tuned 